Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of my Android Baby account. And uh, for those of you that are not familiar with this account, uh, basically what I did was I started an account from scratch on Android and I took it from Private League through to Champion League without any money spent. So that's basically what this account is. Um, if you're kind of curious or you want to follow along, um, I have created a playlist so you'll see that link in the top right corner of the screen and the video description. But uh, yeah, the last video I posted, um, I think I won the skin for my leech which I have here. And I was building uh, the Phantom. So we now have the Phantom to replace my poor Gareth. <laughs> um, I have Ignite and Blaze on here. Here are the modules or module. And a uh, funny story here. I was going to use my uh, pilot from my Gareth uh, to put on the Phantom. But uh, as I was doing that, I noticed I had the legendary pilot uh, for the Phantom. I guess I must have won this uh, from one of the events. I'll have to check. Uh, through my videos but uh, yeah so we have this on uh, you know the phantom here and uh, you know in terms of my stats so we're at 62 percent which is extremely high I'm expecting to run into a string of losses soon but uh, this is basically what my hangar looks like so a level 6 and I guess a level 5 phantom and my weapons range from level 7 through to uh, 9 and uh, there is my author. My uh, modules are just, uh, you know, the basic modules. And uh, what I will be doing today as well is uh, opening up the special delivery crates. I have, um, I think, 500 event coins uh, saved up. So we're at level 29 going on to 30 uh, for the operations. Not very far because I don't really play on this account much. Uh, let me just take a look at this. Okay, so we don't have any tasks uh, to com well, we have tasks to complete, but it's going to take a bit of playing there. Um, workshop, if you're kind of wondering, you know, what am I building? Uh, Corona. So I'm planning on building uh, the Redeemer and Corona build. So I'm going to have another Corona on this side. I actually have one already, but I'm going to use uh, Tehran's for the time being here. And then uh, after I'm done, you know, with the Corona, what I actually want to do is build the Al Jung. So what I'll do is I will put the Avengers on the Al Jung. I'll take maybe the Halos and put that onto the Phantom and run that with Ignite. I'm not sure yet. Uh, this build you might think is kind of weird. Okay, so I have the uh, Glacier on here, but I actually found this more effective than the uh, Ember weapon because, um, you know, this uh, build, basically I'm running around trying to get beacons, and with the Ember I found... Um, sometimes it's hard to, I guess, uh, you know, track the enemy with it because of how uh, the firing mechanics is. With this thing, at least when I hit a target, you know, I dish out all that damage and it's kind of almost like instant uh, damage, which is kind of nice. So this actually works out, which is interesting. And uh, yeah, let's take a look at uh, the black market here. So the black market, I have uh, saved up my keys. If you're kind of wondering how did I get so many keys, when I play... I have a key boosters here so you know these are all the free ones here so I use this to boost up my keys and then this way I can save up that thousand which I'm gonna use right now uh, you know what kind of prizes am I hoping for um, to be honest uh, 5,000 gold and 10 million silver would be really nice even the power cells would be nice so those are my top uh, you know prizes I would like so let's go ahead and let's see what we get here The uh, silver, yes, please stop there, yes, because <laughs> I'm going to use this to actually upgrade a couple of things too, and I was running uh, low on silver, so now we have 15 million, which is perfect, and uh, let's take a look at what we have here, because I think I wanted to upgrade, you know, one of my weapons, uh, but yeah, we have 500 uh, coins here, um, I haven't opened up any of these uh you know, envelopes or whatever you want to call it. So uh, let's go ahead. Actually, wait, before I do that, you know, what kind of prizes would I like? Um, I'm thinking, you know what? Maybe the pilot would be nice. Um, I can't really benefit from much here. Maybe the Ravana, Nightingale, and like power cells. Actually, I really want power cells. I know that sounds really weird too, but I kind of use these events to replenish my power cells. So we're getting gold, which is really good. <laughs> gold is always good. Let's see what we get here. So 
So we have more, or we have components for the Nightingale. Uh, the Ravana. And a Dragon Blaze. Hmm, that's interesting because I already have a Blaze. I don't know if I want a third one. But, uh, you know, any weapon is good. Let's keep on going here. And more components uh, to the Nightingale. So those are my prizes. Uh, the gold was definitely a good one. Let me just go back to this. So there you go. And the Blaze. I'm trying to think, you know, what can I run that Blaze on? Because I already have two here. I don't think I need another one. So yeah, I think the best prize for me over there was actually, uh, you know, the gold. So uh, yeah, what we're going to do now is run two games and see how we do with our new Phantom. Okay, so game one we have dropped in on Dreadnought map. And I've uh, started with my Phantom. And funny story here is when I got the Phantom, <laughs> I decided to uh, take it for a test run. I was actually quite amazed at a level 1 Phantom having, you know, more health and more speed than the Gareth. But the thing is, um, you know, when I used it, I think level 3, what actually happened was, and this is funny because I was getting shot and I wanted to heal my uh, Phantom. The only thing is, what happened was, I was looking at my heal and I was like, wait, I don't have a repair unit, uh, what's going on? Well, I had to upgrade it to level 5 before I could uh, heal. So, we are running a level 5 Phantom here. What on earth is happening on this side? Um, you know what? Let me try to see if I can help out here, perhaps. This guy is a shield. Get this guy. Oh, almost. Man, he's so low on health. Come on. Oh. Let's uh, do this. Holy crap. Not good, not good, not good. I didn't want to heal because I knew I was probably going to go down. Um, looks like we might be getting this beacon. We have like two guys there, so that's good. My uh, Titan Bar, taking a look at that. I'm going to drop in with the leech next. Maybe I can push... Um, Center Beacon might be good actually. Let's do this. I think he's going to drop in over here though. Yep. Oh no man. My leech is going to just die. There's no ways I can survive this. <laughs> it's like a level 6 leech. Well, you know what? He did leech onto me. Maybe I can get him down to his last stand. That might be good. Um, someone else is getting him down to his last stand, which is good. Let's do this. Yes! I actually won that. I can't believe it. This guy is going to be another story. And he's got another leech. I just saw him drop in. Yeah. Not going to be able to do much damage to that falcon. That is a super falcon. Um, let me just see. I'm gonna drop in with the Natasha next. Steal it! Oh, <laughs> I actually almost got that too. And that one too. Wait. Watch out for this guy, dude. Just heard a Titan on that side. Um... Come on, get this leech. Steal it! Steal it! Steal it! Steal it! Steal it! Come on! Come on! Steal it! Come on! <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> Man, I was so close to getting it. Okay, wait, what's going on over here? We might get this beacon. We have multiple players moving in over here. I'm gonna drop in with my Arthur uh, to defend here. Let me go for this uh, Falcon first. I have to make sure I stay on this uh, beacon though. He's trying to see if he can push me off. It's not going to work. There's no ways I'm going to give this beacon up. Where is this guy? Um, let's do this. Steal it! 
steal it. Ah. <laughs> Let's get this guy. Um, what's happening on that side? Um, I think they actually have an Ao Ming. It looked like an Ao Ming here in front of me. This guy here near center. This guy is just, uh, well, he didn't suppress me, but he did fire his suppression. Try to get, whoa, I sent him, whoa, <laughs> he went flying. <laughs> That's funny. Come on, take this guy out. And this guy, if I can. Should be able to do this now. Yes. Uh-oh. Where is this guy? He just ran at me. Is he up top? I think he might be up top. I need to push uh, this beacon here at same tip. Let's do this. Trying to get to this beacon quickly. And Deathbot! There's a guy above here. What is he in? Come on, come on, come on, come on. We're gonna do a Deathbot to this guy here. Yep. If he gets close enough. Nope. You know what? I might be able to hit him while he's above. It's possible. I have to uh, check the range here. He is right above me, and now, so I got him, that's once. Um, is he behind me? I see someone behind me actually. Where is he? I try to use the ability again just in case he's there. I might be able to get him. Uh, where is that guy? Let's try to take this guy out. Let's do that. And we got him. Maybe this one here too. There we go. And now. Whoa, jeez. I got him pretty good. Look at that. Okay, let's... Three versus three, guys. He's uh, making his way up top here, but I'm going to get him again. Look at this. There we go. <laughs> Nice! And this guy, let's try to get him. We have three beacons, so that's definitely a very good thing. Uh, this guy's face shift's gonna wear off here. There we go. Um, where are these guys? It's now four versus two. We need to push this beacon if we can. If I can get close enough, I might be able to get this guy with the death part too. I'm trying to shoot through my teammate's legs here. Actually, I'm trying to steal. <laughs> trying to steal this kill. Come on, closer. 140, 140. Uh-oh. Now. Yes, I stole it. <laughs> Whoa, that guy's bot went flying. <laughs> uh, we have multiple players there. Wait, what is this guy in? You know what? I'm going to use the Falcon. Get this guy down. Ah, he used his phase shift. But I'm going to get... Uh, try to get to this uh, beacon. Sit on this beacon. Make sure that... You know, it's going to take him a while to get uh, this beacon. He's going to use his ability. So I have to make sure I have my heal here. Yep, there we go. And... Just wearing him off, or wearing him down a bit. I'm gonna push this other beacon here. A little bit more damage. And let's go for this beacon here. Capture this beacon. There we go. And I think, you know what, that's going to be game. 
because we have a four cap on them. There's no way they're gonna be able to win this. Um, you know, four versus one. So uh, there we go. Uh, let's take a look to see how I did here in this first game using my Phantom. And uh, let's take a look. 2.1 million, eight kills, five beacons. Whoa, <laughs> that's pretty good. So we ended up actually coming third, but I got like six gold here. Uh, let me take a look to see what happened in terms of my teammates. So uh, this player here coming first. And uh, what is he running? So he's running the uh, following hangar and a level 25 kid. And you know what? I actually scored as much as him. This guy, uh, not so much. This player here. Uh, let's take a look at uh, you know what he's running and uh, he is running the following hangar and a level 34 kid and the other team actually was down a player okay so i consider this being uh, you know down a player here uh, but we were going up against a duo squad so uh, let's take a look at you know what these guys were running and uh, they were running the following uh, you know hangar and a level 15 kid And his teammate, or clanmate, uh, this is what they were running. And a level 17 Alming. I think this was the Alming that was in the center uh, when I made my way there with, um, I think it was the Arthur. I can't remember which uh, bot I had. But, uh, you know, that's pretty much uh, the first game. Let's take a look at the honor points. So that's the breakdown. And you know what? Let's drop into game two and let's see how we do uh, with this lineup. Okay, so game two we have dropped in on Dead City map. And I've uh, started uh, with my Phantom here. I already see a Phantom uh, to this right side. Um, what is this other guy in? That looks like a Hechi. Okay, so we have a Hechi and a Phantom on this side. Uh, let's try to see if we can maybe attack this guy. And come on, keep running, come on. We're actually doing some decent damage here to him too. Just uh, heal up. Maybe I can get this beacon. No, I can't. Ah! <laughs> this guy's going to kill me here. Where is he? I got to go for this one. I'm actually going to run this way, not the other way, because of the guy behind me. Uh, he's chasing me down. And i got to help out with this guy here if I can. Oh, shoot. I was able to trick him, I think. Maybe I can get this beacon. Let's see. Is he here? He doesn't realize I'm behind him. Let's uh, place this uh, point down. Uh-oh, uh-oh. The thing is, he doesn't have any ammo. Yes! <laughs> Come on! Come on, heal, heal, heal. I need to reload. Oh man, I'm turning into a popsicle. Come on, we gotta take this guy out. And... Yes! Okay, so we have four beacons on the other team here. This uh, phantom is really helping me out with <laughs> running beacons. Let's move this way. What is this guy up to? Let's try to see if we can perhaps uh, help out here. There we go. Um, let's just see what's going on on this side. You know what? I think these guys are going to attack uh, on the right side. So I'm going to move to the left and uh, put some pressure on this beacon. Okay, let's do this. Maybe push this beacon. I think they're actually getting our right beacon or something. Let's try to go for this beacon here. Come on, come on, come on. Let's get this beacon. Uh-oh. Wait a minute. He death mocked me. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Come on. I gotta hold it down. Come on. Yes! 
Yes! <laughs> this guy's gonna roast me up. Yeah, he's totally gonna smoke me. <laughs> but you know what? I got that uh, left beacon there, which is great. Um, let's drop in over here with the Natasha. And steal it! Come on! Steal it! Steal it! Steal it! Steal it! Yes! Yes! <laughs> this guy's looking. He's turning around. He's like, who stole my kill? <laughs> Come on, this guy too. Come on, steal it! Let's knock this guy's a shield down here. Okay, he, <laughs> he can take care of the Ao Jung here. <laughs> I'll give him that. Oh man! No, 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 no! <laughs> this guy... Wait, why did this guy go after me? He could have so got this beacon. Maybe he wants to get destroyed by a Natasha. There we go. And maybe take out uh, this guy here. Oh, shoot! I didn't see this guy. Whoa! <laughs> um, what's going on here? Okay, you know what? I'm going to drop in over here with the Arthur. And defend against this guy because this is what, I guess, uh, Fenrir. Let's do this to knock that shield down a bit. These guys are actually pushing uh, some serious beacons here on us. Can I stop this guy, Pap? Steal it! Ah! Maybe I can shoot over here. Yeah, I can! Steal it! Steal it! Come on! Steal it! Steal it! Steal it! Ah! Shoot! Come on, get it! Yes! <laughs> Wait a minute, why is my team, we only have four guys left? Five guys. What is this guy in? Um, okay, so they have... I want to actually push uh, the center here, but probably not a good idea. With that uh, leech. I think we're going to win this, so look at the beacon bar. But I will uh, include this game because I had a really good run with that uh, Phantom. You got to keep in mind my Phantom's like level 5. What's uh, shooting me in the... wait. I'm going to death bot this guy if he gets too close. Steal it! Come on, steal it! Oh, so close. Let me try to steal this one. <laughs> Wait, this guy... Oh, come on! Steal it! Steal this one, please. Thank you. Whoa! <laughs> Back up! Back up! Oh, shoot. <laughs> but you know what? I think we're going to win. Yep, we're going to win. Just as well, too. I think we were losing uh, all our players there. But yeah, let's take a look to see how I did. Uh, in this game, I had a really good run with that uh, Phantom. And uh, let's take a look here. So, not a very high score. But we did get uh, three beacons. And I got uh, gold for that. So, that was pretty cool. Um, let's take a look to see uh, what this player is running here. And uh, this player is uh, running the following hangar. With a level 16 kid. And uh, let me take a look at this other player. Uh, this player is running the following hangar. Some MK2 level 18 Arthur. And uh, you guys can take a look at you know what I'm running here on my uh, bots. I just noticed we hit 62% uh, win percentage. <laughs> which means I'm going to go through a string of losses here soon. But uh, this is my hangar. And those are the pilot levels. Um, in terms of modules, you can see I have like basic stuff. A level 8 Arthur. And uh, let's take a look at the other team here. So uh, this guy here, also in Champion League. And uh, this guy running some MK2 stuff. Quite a bit of MK2 stuff. Level 10 Ao Ming. And their teammate. Also in Champion League. And uh, this guy is running the following hangar with some MK2 stuff as well. A level 4 kid. 
And in terms of uh, the honor points, so uh, here's the breakdown in terms of honor points. So uh, yeah, one thing I wanted to do before I end things here is to show you the modules uh, on my bots because I had a couple of players ask me, uh, you know, what kind of modules are you running on your bots at the moment? Uh, is it upgraded? Uh, do you have last end and stuff? Um, no. <laughs> Nuclear reactor level 1 for the Natasha. Uh, the Falcon has armor kit level 1. Phantom has uh, armor kit level 1. Fenrir, armor kit level 1. And the Leech, armor kit level 1. And I guess, uh, you know, the Arthur, everything is level 1. Basic. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. So, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. And if you haven't yet subscribed, consider subscribing. Until the next video, I'll catch you guys later.